Hey everyone, uh, this is me, Robert. I am in barking on another uh, project because I always get bored, apparently. So um, I started doing some hydroponics. I bought a Kickstarter program, uh, Window Farms, and it ended up being like okay. However, there's some, some, well, there was a lot of problems with it, essentially. Um, the cups that were in the pots didn't allow the root systems to get long enough and so there was a lot of clogging and then water was dripping everywhere and then it's just there was leakage and then it was just it wasn't ideal for what I was expecting out of it so I went on um, online and I found a guy that was making these um, these hydroponic towers that are based on like another design that you can buy that's incredibly expensive um, so I ended up making it um, on the recommendation of another youtuber that kinda tweaked the design a little bit um, and so I did that as well as he did and I believe it's roughly six feet tall um, I'm gonna make two of these that are gonna be part of an aquaponic system um, that's gonna have like a, a base and all that good stuff. I believe it's gonna be maybe 30, 40, 50 gallons of water basically in this. Um, I haven't really checked that part yet. But as you can see, I have the pump. I have in the bathtub right now just to check for fittings to make sure that everything's working properly. And so far it's doing pretty good. Um, I definitely will need some type of flow uh, monitor this pump that I got was even stronger than it needed to be um, just because I was going to be running two towers off of it right now I have um, let's see if I can get to this I have PVC pipe in here that is I don't know if you can see it right through there oh, maybe you can see it through there um, well there's there's PVC pipe in there and because of the, or not PVC pipe, but like rubber tubing that I got from Home Depot or Lowe's. And essentially it is, it's not ideal because then it's making this top part that I have. Um, it's making the inside of this, sorry, let me put this down. Um, it's making the inside of this kind of fall and it's not um, sitting up straight it's kind of uh, flowing to the side so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get some small um, more PVC pipe and it's just gonna be in the center of this going all the way down and then I'll have an attachment in the base of this and then the PVC or this tubing rubber tubing will just go to the pumps outside of these towers I also um, put some extra tubing around the edges just so it was a better fit and then there's a hole on the bottom um, I used another of the these tops right here and then I ended up cutting this part out and then gluing the remainder piece so as this part sits on the bottom of there it actually clamps on and it's kind of like a um, I guess a uh, like a a guiding post so it actually sounds up correctly so but for the most part it's done I have one more to make um, and I'm just hoping that I can uh, get a lot of um, uh, lettuce and kale and all the good stuff out of this um, my tomatoes upstairs are doing really well and I also have a lot of uh, Napa lettuce upstairs too and then um, I also have a eggplant which is doing well so then I'll transfer it into here hopefully it works out really well but anyways um, here it is I can turn it on not get electrocuted but a little bit louder than I expected this is actually gonna be going inside of my house I live in San Francisco so I don't really have a yard so um, no, as far yeah, it's, it's pretty cool, but you can see that there's just way too much water flowing in there now. I'm gonna have to go buy another um, control valve so then that way I can slow this down. 
Um, this pump comes with a control valve, but it's like a proprietary kind of pump. So all the pieces that they give you basically only work with the pieces they provide you. So I have to buy something else, some PVC or something. So when I put that on, um, that middle piece onto uh, as the feeding tube, I'll put like some type of um, valve on the bottom or something like that. Anyways, um, yeah, it's pretty much done. I'm pretty happy with it. And I will hopefully follow up with um, another video with it actually um, having plants in them. So anyways, talk to you soon. Bye.